Hey guys, welcome to Cute Tea Drawings. Today I'll be drawing Karomi as a fortune teller. I'll be drawing on my tablet, but you can also follow along on paper, and please remember to like and subscribe. Okay, now let's get started. Okay, I'm going to first start off by drawing the bow on the head. I'll start with a small curved line across. Then bring it down on both sides, and connect it at the bottom. Now from the top, let's curve it up and out on both sides. and then a curve out from the bottom corners. Now to close off each side of the bow, let's draw two bumps down. Next, let's hop inside and let's draw two curves up and out from the top. Then let's leave a gap and let's draw two more inside the bottom section. And lastly, a small curve inside at the middle. Next, let's hop down and let's draw the ends of the bow going down. Let's start with two curved lines on an angle going out on the left and on the right. and then connect it at the ends with an angled line. And now inside each one, let's add two more angles in the center. And that's it for the bow. Next, let's hop underneath and let's draw the skull. We'll start underneath the center of the bow and let's draw a curve down and in on both sides. Then add a small rectangle shape underneath. Next, let's hop inside and let's draw two angled ovals in the bottom corners. And then color both of these in black. Lastly, inside the rectangle at the bottom, let's draw three lines. Next, let's hop down underneath and let's draw two angled lines coming to a point in the center. Now let's move down and let's draw the face starting with the eyes. Underneath each side of the ribbon, let's draw an angled line down. Then let's draw a long U-shaped curve underneath each one. Now inside each eye, let's add a small oval inside the top right corner. And then next to it on the left, a small circle. And now let's color both of the eyes in black. And lastly, on the outside of each eye, let's add two eyelashes. And that's it for the eyes. Now let's move in between and let's draw a sideways oval for the nose. And that's it for the face. Now let's draw the shape of the head. Let's start on the sides underneath the bow and let's draw a curve down and in on both sides. Now let's hop up next to the top of the bow and let's draw another curve down, meeting the other line at a point. And the same thing on the right. And now on top of the bow in the center, let's draw the top of the head with a small curve across. Next, let's add the ears on top. Let's start on the top left of the bow and let's draw an angle up and the same on the right. Now let's angle it back down. And bring it in at the bottom. And lastly, let's add a circle at the top of each ear. And 
And that's it for the ears. Now let's move back down and let's draw the hands. On the bottom corners, let's draw an angled oval shape on both sides. And then inside at the bottom, let's draw three angled lines. Now next to the hands, let's draw another small curve in on both sides for the bottom of the head. Now next to the left hand, let's draw a curve down and then bring it back up. And now the same thing on the right side. And then at the end of each one, let's add a small circle. Now in that gap, let's add the crystal ball. Let's start in the gap and let's draw a large circle. Next, let's add some details inside. On the bottom left corner, let's draw a curve. And then next to it, let's draw four curves forming a star shape. And then the same thing on the upper right. And lastly, let's add some small circles inside. And that's it for the details. Now let's move down and let's draw the stand. Let's start underneath and let's draw a set of curves down. And then close it off with a curve at the bottom. Now let's move inside and let's draw another curve closer to the top. Now inside, let's draw a small head. Let's start with a curve, then pointed ears up on both sides, and then a curve to close off the bottom. And now inside, let's draw two ovals for the eyes. and color them both in black. And that's it for the crystal ball. Now let's draw the pillow. From the sides, let's draw angled lines down and out. Then step up from the bottom and let's draw a small curve out. And then curve it down to the center, meeting at a point. Now inside, at the bottom, let's draw two S-shaped curves down. And then we're going to draw hearts on each of the corners. So one at the bottom, and then two on the sides. And that's it for Kuromi and the crystal ball. Now let's add some details around. Let's start on top and let's draw another four-pointed star in the same way as before. And then a circle next to it on the left. Now let's hop over to the bottom right and let's draw another star. And then two circles. Now hop over to the left side, and for this side, let's draw two stars. And two circles. And that's it for Fortune Teller Kuromi. Now let's quickly color it in. And done. Hope you enjoyed drawing along with me and please remember to hit that like button and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching.